Uh, hello, this is Alex Koloskov at Agile Studio and today we get a uh, very special guest with very special equipment, uh, Steve Hendricks from Capture Integration and he brought a very uh, new and cool uh, digital bag from the leaves, the top uh, of the line and uh, he's gonna uh, tell you a little bit about uh, uh, the device itself. When you think about leaf, I mean they were, you know, right at the beginning of, of digital capture for uh, medium format, large right. format cameras, you know, early 90s, 91, 92, right in there they were starting. A couple years ago they were acquired by phase one, right. and uh, some of what has happened since in terms of uh, the interest in LEAF has centered around what happens with LEAF, do they mm -hmm. get gobbled up by phase one and everything winds up being a phase one branded or, or what? And as you can see, it's it's still very much um, Leaf brand, and uh, everything that that Phase One has said publicly, everything that we have discussed internally with Phase One indicates they still value Leaf as a as a independent brand, and they are essentially a, a division of Phase One. It's the largest sensor on the the market right now, so it's. Uh, it's going to cover. It's it covers a, a six four five uh, frame. Uh, essentially, there's there's a little bit uh, that it doesn't cover, but it's so tiny that you couldn't design a, a mask to put in the viewfinder to right. to show your shooting area. So, you know, it's it's as close to the full frame as, as you can get. Um, it's uh, eighty megapixels. Uh, so again, that's that's the most available. Um, it does have some unique technologies in the back uh, where you can um, put in a, a crop into the back. So if you want to shoot a, a square or uh, a different ratio or a smaller size file, yeah. it'll do that right in the back. So like, like a mask crop? Right, it'll yeah. actually, it'll, well, and the file itself is changed. It'll okay. be, mm -hmm. if I say I want, uh, instead of 80, I want a 60 megapixel file, it'll shoot a 60 megapixel file in the shape mm -hmm. that I've selected. Um, so that's kind of a unique thing. Um, Leaf was the first back to ever have a, a touch screen interface. I personally think they did a great job with it because they also put more control into the back than, um, even today maybe, than any other back had had up to that point. You could change color settings, all kinds of things. Probably is the same sensor as the Phase 1 IQ 180. Right. If we shot both backs, uh, right out of the box, you'd have a, a very different look, even in the same software. Mm -hmm. So uh, there is cooperation with Leaf in Phase One, where Leaf engineers are definitely specifying that the Leaf comes in and uses a, a certain look, as opposed to right. however they've done. Different uh, algorithms and different kind of software inside the bag. Okay, great. Let's uh, let me see. Uh, let's start uh, shooting, and we'll see it in real.